Absolutely. Um, again, I, I really admire your strength in being here today. Um, and I, and I want to thank you for that. I'm going to give you some time to talk about, you know, what, what do you believe are the, the, you know, in terms of the failures and what are the foundational aspects of strong whistleblower protections that need to be in this bill that might not be in the bill yet that we could look at to strengthen the bill uh, and work with our friend and colleague as well. Yeah. I think that we all have to gain by working all together, every one of you, regardless of the party you represent. We all represent you, the public servant. And when the problem fa that we face is people in high position of authority that are engaged in wrongdoing or criminal activity, we have nobody to turn to. And the mechanism in place to report it turns over the information that we give and the evidence that we have to the people that are the ones that we are reporting on. This cannot continue. We cannot continue that way because it, it's, it's not conducive. It, it's, 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 it's impossible to continue that way. We need to have an, a, an independent party that will, will take the information and protect us and protect everybody else and give the opportunity to any law enforcement agency to investigate discreetly to see the magnitude of the problem that we have or whatever damage that was done. It's very important that this, this concept is done. Otherwise, the system keeps failing us. Thank you for your, thank you for your, okay. thank you for your service, too, to Canada. Thank you, sir. And 